So don't play politics with our kids. Democratic lawmakers joined parents outside the Orange County School District offices, yeah. urging the board and administration to extend beyond October 30th the mandatory mask order for students and adults. Joanne Respress, a nurse and parent, was in tears explaining why she doesn't want her first grader at risk in class. I've experienced firsthand the death that has occurred in our children. It was one child, but one is too many. Democrats are upset that Governor Ron DeSantis and other Republican leaders are organizing a special session aimed at curbing COVID-19 mandates and protecting Florida workers from a federal contractor mandate that requires vaccinations. I don't want more people to die. I don't want kids to die. And I really don't want this to get dragged on, which is why, of course, I'm frustrated by the governor. We're here to fight COVID. And our governor is trying to fight President Biden for his job. Opposing the call for a mask extension in schools were parents and others outside the district office. They say their kids are uncomfortable, distracted, learning less at a time when COVID cases are dropping. It should be the parents' right to choose what's best for their kids. If the parents want to put a mask on their kid, I have no issues with that. That's their right as a parent. Now they're saying, oh, wait. The numbers are great, but we need to do more. So at what point is it finished and you just have to live with the virus? The dueling demonstrations had police and deputies nearby, but remained peaceful. Orange County School Board members will meet Tuesday afternoon at 5, and the group that is supporting an extension of the mask mandate are asking the public to show up and support. In Orlando, Greg Fox, Washington News. School District does not...